Oh no, the the medicine cabinet's so far away. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. We're gonna die already. It is time for some barrow trauma. Probably a short time, I reckon. I know I should come in here with some confidence, but this is permadeath, and I've played a decent amount of this game. I love it. I love it so much, but I don't survive long, okay? So the story is, we work on a submarine under the ice, not only under the ice, but under the ice on one of Jupiter's moons. This is the submarine we're gonna start with, the Barsook, I think is how you pronounce it. This will be our starting crew. As you can see, yes, I am the captain, okay? Don't worry, you can trust me. Don't worry, you can trust me. And we have an engineer and mechanic. These are just randomized. All I know is Gerard doesn't look happy to be here at all. All we can do now is head out to Europa and make some money. Let me just give you a little tour of the submarine. Right now we're docked at this little underwater station, so we're safe, but this is where our diving suits are, and this is where we leave the sub. Now, I'm not gonna press this button because I will die. Um, I don't have a diving suit on. This is where we store things. So that's, that's nice. This is where the gunners will be, okay. This is where they'll man the turrets, as you can see. If you haven't been down here, that might be alarming. Why do we have turrets on our submarine? Calm down, it's fine, okay. And this is where I captain the vessel. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much the main, main rooms. This is where our engineer's gonna be. They're gonna work the engine. I don't know any of this stuff. Look at it, it's complicated, it's scary, so I don't do it. What I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna speak to the outpost manager. We are docked at an outpost and we wanna get a mission. We hired a crew to transport these materials, but they never showed. The stuff is still here. If you want the job, I'll take it. She has another mission. There's this especially mean monster terrorizing the caves near here. I've put a little reward aside for the crew that takes it down. Some of the commoners here are looking for safe passage to a nearby station. Escort them over there safely and you'll be paid. So basically what we're doing is we're trying to get deeper into the ocean. As you can see, you can go very far. Um, I've not made it far, like I said. I'm gonna go here to this outpost because we do have a mission to go there anyways, so let's just do it. All right, first things first, as the captain, I'm gonna charge over to my men and give them orders. Okay, Bridget, repair mechanical systems, fix leaks. Nothing's broken right now. This is just in case this happens. Gerard, operate reactor and repair electrical systems. As you can see, yes, sir, got it. They obey me. I also wanna make sure people are doing their jobs. Now, this is my interface. The awesome thing is I have autopilot. I can just click on this and the submarine's just gonna autopilot to the next outpost. I can just lay back now. And you know what I'm gonna do? Seeing as we don't have anybody on this gun, I'll just operate it, you know? So everyone, focus on the task at hand. I am laying down the law. I am the captain after all. And it's very quiet. Another thing I can do real quick as we're going, I can do this. I can go on the active sonar and this will show things. Now that's something moving right there. I'm gonna turn off the sonar because it is loud. Now, I don't think it was these things, because they're small. They look like nice fishies. There was something bigger up here. Pop one of those. Okay, it is there. Oh, it's coming. Okay. Okay. Yep, it made some noise, the sonar. Oh. Oh, and it's dead. Okay, Bridget got it, whatever it is. And, I mean, it looks like we made it to the outpost. That was a very smooth ride. I expected it. Like I said, we're not deep at all. Oh, okay. Now, docking, listen. Gerard, uh, Gerard, you messed me up. Guys, I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. I just, uh, try <laughs> I've been a captain for a while. I know what I'm doing. Um, Gerard just electrocuted himself. Gerard, are you okay, buddy? Okay, he's fine. Okay, so this is docking at the outpost right now. Um, episode 57. Oh, uh, we have to match it up perfectly. And then we hit the dock. And then we, yep, yep. There we are. Expert. Expert docking. It's gonna get sketchy. Okay, I want to do two missions here. First, we're gonna transport some personnel. We have to keep them safe. We're just gonna have to transport some random people, keep them alive. I know. Listen, I have social anxiety as well. Okay, it stresses me out, but you know what? Whatever. The thing we do have to worry about is killing hammerheads, which I am gonna do because I want money. As you can see, these are the randos on our ship just walking around. However, you know what I did get? A harpoon gun. Check this out, man. Not only that, I have a revolver, so we have that. I also have a crowbar that I can just hip. Oh, oh, let me uh, patch that up. Just kind of damage our ship a little bit there, but you know what? I'm just excited, okay? I have a crowbar. I can, I can hit things and stuff, so that's cool. Um. Okay, the hammerhead's already here. That was not expected at all. Okay, um, I'm gonna get a diving suit on, which I just now realize we don't have enough, so if this place floods, people are definitely gonna die. Okay, where's that hammerhead at? Oh my god. Where's he at? There he is. Look at that thing. It's terrifying. Let me first get the ship moving. Let's autopilot. Oh god. I saw it on the sonar. It's coming. Shoot it. Yeah, take that, buddy. Are we sinking? Or is it because I autopilot? I don't know. Let's just shoot it. The 
this thing's coming in for another attack. Yeah, there we go. As you can see on the sonar, I can see its dead body right there. So yeah, if it was alive and you saw this big blip on the sonar, be scared, man. I do see a blip on the radar. Right out front. You see that thing? It's small. We're going to see him in a couple seconds here. Oh. Okay, those things are not nice. I do know that. Okay. Oh, one of them's already breaking in. Oh, I missed. That's bad. That's really bad news. Okay. I'm going to take out my welding tool. This is to patch up walls. As you can see, they're, they are trying to break in. Okay, good job. Richard got both of them, it looked like. It's coming back up, which is worrying because we don't have a turret on the bottom. So, uh... I'm going to... Let's just dock. Let's see if we can dock. Come on. Before it gets us. Come on. Dock. Please. Okay. A little bit sketchier, I have to say. I am now going to go to the doctor immediately and get my blunt force trauma treated. So we're going to treat everybody, which will only cost seven marks. We have 6,000. You know what wouldn't be a bad idea? Getting another guy. There's a lot of guys here. We can be cheap and hire an assistant, which won't be that good. But honestly, Timur Hawker, that's a badass name. Okay, we're going to get him. I hope you understand. Instead of killing a large monster, what we're going to do is we're going to mine some quartz. This is still going to be sketchy. Don't get me wrong, because we're going to have to leave to mine. We're going to have to go out swimming outside the sub, and that's pretty sketchy. We should get a coffee maker on board. I don't drink coffee. Okay, we're not to a great start with Timur. Things seem kind of awkward. However, we have to put that aside. Okay, Timur, I'm going to grab you real quick. I'm going to give you the stun baton. The reason I'm doing that is Tamur has the important mission of fighting intruders. Now, let's just hope nothing gets on. Now, we're going to start our long trek towards the outpost. It seems the quartz is right next to the outpost, so we're just going to have to travel for now. Got some tunes going. Yeah. Yeah. Got some tunes going. Now, one thing I want to clarify is about the whole permadeath thing, right? So any of these guys can die at any time. Even me, even the captain can die. As long as we make it to the other outpost, they'll go on without me. What permadeath means, if we all die and the submarine like sinks, that's where it ends. The series is over. Gerard is loading more fuel to the reactor, of course, right when the reactor shuts down. Gerard, buddy, we're, we're, we have no power right now. What, what's going on over here? Do you have fuel in there? Yes, you do. Come on, let's be quicker next time. Now, I can't say I'm too excited about the idea of leaving the ship. I'm going to send one of the other guys out. All right, they're going to do it for me. Oh, I see something on the radar. Oh, I see three things on the radar. They saw us. Okay. Let's start shooting. Okay. This is good. The problem is they're in my blind spot now. And we have no guns at the bottom. Guys, let's uh, patch the holes, please. Thank you. Ow. Ow. God damn, the door nearly cut off my leg. The problem is none of our turrets have any angle on them, so I'm going to try and angle it because our turret, Bridget's up here. Bridget's turret is right, Bridget's turret, Bridget's turret is right here. Sorry, this is a very tense scenario. Why are we flooding? Guys, why are we flooding? Okay, we need to patch these holes, okay? This is what you're, I'll just do it. God damn. Oh, that is an opening. Oh, I got to patch that. They can slink on through. The funny thing is, this is smooth sailing in Barotrauma. Right now, I'd consider this smooth sailing as two things are trying to munch us. Oh no, there's three other things trying to kill us right now. Oh, I'm not gonna get a good view on anything. Oh, I'm getting a view on the wall that we're about to hit. Oh God, listen, don't worry, I know what I'm doing. I know this doesn't look good. We're being surrounded. I just collided with a wall. The problem is we have to go out and mine. So we need to deal with these things before we leave the sub. Oh, there's one more, come on, get him. Enemy down, nice one, Bridget. Okay, now we have to go out and mine. So I can't take control of my other guys. Tamur or security officer. He's going to go out mining as if he can climb the ladder. So let's go. So we're going to hit this button. It's going to let us out. I know it's sketchy. It's very sketchy to go out right now. Seeing as uh, we had a couple encounters back there, you could say, but we are pretty close. I'm pretty sure the ore. Yeah, we see it right here. Yep. This is the quartz we need. We just need to mine all of it. And I mean, hopefully if something sneaks up on me, which could be at any moment, the submarine will shoot him. Why is the captain saying, did you hear that? Some deep groaning sound from the outside. That's not good. Okay. Bridget says, probably just the hull. Relax. Yeah. Dragony says, paranoid. I am paranoid. I'm a paranoid captain. Okay. Let's just hope that is the hull because I'm going to have to go back there pretty soon. Let's just get all the quartz that we just mined. Seems fine. We're just going to go in here. There we are. Okay, that's good. So we're now at the outpost, and I want to do something very important. Okay, we're going to buy 
a turret for the bottom of our sub. So as you can see, we can buy so many upgrades for our sub. We can buy hull upgrades, which I do want to do. As you can see, we have a turret here, which is basically a machine gun, the coil gun. And we have a pulse laser there, which I've used. We don't have a turret down here, and that's what I want. We can only afford a coil gun, so I'm just going to buy that. I don't care. As long as we have a turret, I'll be fine. All right, so I have some bad news, okay? We have three missions. It's either killing a swarm of mud raptors, killing a large crawler, or killing a hammerhead. And all of those are sketchy. I think the smartest move is to kill a large crawler. The only issue is where we're going is uninhabited. There's no outpost here. We better hope this mission goes well because there's no outpost to go and hide at, okay? We do have this new turret. Okay, we're gonna have Timur on the turret. I want you to be on this turret and I'll get on the pulse laser whenever I have to. You know what I'm noticing on our little navigation panel right now that they didn't explain to me? The mission said killing a large crawler. Why am I seeing like 10 of them? Thankfully, we have a few minutes here just to relax and brace ourselves for what comes next. And uh, yeah, I'll see you there. Okay, it looks like a lot of blips on the radar here. Okay, maintain position. Can we get on the gun? Oh, these are mud raptors. That's not what I wanted. Oh no. Oh no. Guys, get back on the guns. Oh, there's a mud raptor in. This is not good. Let me get my gun out here. Oh God. The ship's just moving around. I don't want to shoot my friends. This thing is moving around too fast. Bridget's almost dead. Okay, there we go. Got a shot on. Got another shot. Timur, do your job, dude. You're supposed to kill this thing. Okay, Bridget's like passed out. What's going on with Bridget? Uh, blood loss. I'm going to perform CPR. Oh, no. Uh, okay, we need, we need band-aids. Oh, no. The, the medicine cabinet's so far away. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. We're gonna die already. This is this has been a very very fun experience, but uh, the series is over. I, I hate to say it, the series is over. Okay, let's get uh, morphine, saline. She's already dead, isn't? It? Yeah, she just died. Okay. Um, okay, let's just maintain position here, guys. Everybody, do your thing. Let me get on the turret. Oh, there's one right there. Close range fire. Got him, Tamur. Okay, Tamur. I'm gonna quickly bandage him. He has blood loss going on. Okay, bandage. Um concussion. I'll give you some morphine. Don't get addicted, buddy. And uh, let's start patching some holes here. Oh, the door's open. Okay. Oh, that's the large one. Ow. Okay, I harpooned him. He's dead. Good, good, good. Um. Ow! No, he's not dead. What? Okay, now he's dead. And I'm out of ammo. Our mechanic did die, which means no mechanicing is going on. So let me take the wrench and screwdriver. This is not looking good at all. I'm gonna- um. Okay, that thing's dead. That's good. I'm going to get- Oh, that thing's not dead, though. Let me close this door first. Oh, God. Gotta get a good shot on him. Yeah, take that, buddy. Take that. Another harpoon. I have limited harpoons, so I have to be smart. There we go. Killed him before anything else gets in here. Take my screwdriver stuff out. We're gonna go over here. Let's repair it. This has been a, just a bad experience overall. Everything's broken. As you can see, my sonar is like freaking out. Okay, we need to get these things fixed before we can go anywhere right now. Ah, and I just electrocuted myself, so that's good. I don't think I want to touch that anymore. I don't know how to do these things. I just realized that we actually weren't heading towards an outpost. We're in an uninhabited place. The smart approach would be just to head to this outpost, okay? We just need to head here. There's no mission, but... The mission is survival right now because we need to recover. All right, folks, let's take her out for a spin. Dragon East, it's not the time to be all chipper, all right? We just lost Bridget. As you can see, here's her duffel bag. Rest in peace. I'm going to take her tool belt so I can put my wrench and screwdriver. Yes, I'm looting a dead member of my team. I know. It's not the best. However, there is a bright side. We got a skill point. I'm going to get this. We're going to get a one-time bonus of 20 helm, which helps us steer the ship, which obviously we need. Here goes nothing. We're going to start autopiloting towards the outpost. There's a long journey ahead of us, man. So hull breach and reactor room. Ooh, that's a bad breach, too. I might want to go over there. Patch it up. Is everything good, Gerard? I notice you're not doing your job right now. You're not patching anything up. Oh, they're at the top now. They're at the top. Let's get on the gun. Let's get on the gun quick. Oh, they're mud raptors. Yeah, we have to take these out. Just unload. I have no ammo anymore. Okay, let's just take the ammo. Take the ammo out of here. Take the empty ammo. Put the real ammo in. Okay. Take that, buddy. Yeah. 
just shot his head off. That feels good. Oh no. Oh, there's two things. What are those? We're about to see him any second now. Oh, more mud raptors. Ooh, I definitely got him. There's one mud raptor still alive. Are we gonna hit that? We're gonna hit it, aren't we? Oh, yeah, we are. Oh, I'm gonna drown. Okay, there we go. Let's patch this up quick. This is a good show of my captaining. You know, I just hit an ice spire. Nice. Oh! Oh, we hit something big. Oh, we're going down. We're going down fast. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Brace. Oh. Okay, we just hit the ocean floor. Uh, let's hope that mud raptor is not coming this way, because it will get in and probably kill us. I'm gonna get my harpoon gun out, because who knows where the mud raptor is. I don't think we killed it. Bandage morphine saline. I'm gonna inject myself with some morphine. Uh, we're gonna. I think it's all I needed. Is everything fine? Got the situation under control, people? The most dangerous part of that was crashing. It wasn't even the mud raptor. It was just me being a bad captain. Guys, I want to formally apologize for my actions back there. Timmer just, he just electrocuted himself. Okay, I don't apologize anymore. We have officially made it out. Unless something attacks us in the next 10 to 15 seconds, we should be fine. I have to say, I was not expecting to survive that. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get some ethanol, medical alcohol. Cheers to Bridget, because we lost a good one back there. That feels good, man. Feels good to get a nice buzz going, as you can see. I do have to say this first episode was a little rough. Okay, let's be honest. Let's address- Oh god, I just puked everywhere. Um, thankfully the guards didn't see it. I have organ damage. Apparently I have organ damage now, so uh, that's something to address in the next episode, but for now we're gonna end it. I hope you enjoy this new series. It's gonna be fun. It probably won't last too long, because like I said, it is permadeath, and you saw what happened in the first episode alone, okay? But yeah, anyways, let's see how far we go. And in the meantime, I hope you enjoyed the video, and I hope you have a good one. See ya. Don't worry, you can trust me. Are we gonna hit that? We're gonna hit it, aren't we? Oh, yeah, we are. Yeah.